Hello, Georgie Burns here. Today I'd like to show you how I made this card. This card came from Pinterest. Um, I'm just looking up to see who made it. I did keep it. So I can tell you who made this card. Sarah Rayner, 19, oh, she's been stamping for 20 years, but that's who made this card, it's on Pinterest, so I'm going to show you how I made it. To make this card I'm using Peaceful Moments for the Sentiment Happy Birthday and Painted Poppies for the Big Poppy and that flower card I've got a card base of basic grey of eight and a quarter by five and seven eighths scored at four and one eighth for folded in half I have put my white piece in the middle already I have a white card blank at five and five eighths by three and seven eighths if you put one inside you'll need two of these that goes on top I have a white piece of card at two and a quarter by three and five eighths. So I have a red piece at two and three eighths by three and three quarters, which sits just like that. And that will sit on top there. So let's get our stamping done. Right, the ink I'm going to use, just get a scrap piece of paper, is basic grey. It's the only ink I'm using. And my big poppy, I am just going to stamp poppies all over the paper card. Turning it round just so we can get our poppies at different angles, and I'm just going over the poppies slightly, not all the time. And one more, and just a bit there. I need that. So that is our background done. Um, just the poppies. Let's put a little line just so we. That's it. Don't want a big blank piece, did we? Right. With this little tiny piece, the smaller piece. We'll get our flower on a stem and we're going to stamp that there. Like that. And then with our happy birthday, we're going to stamp that at the bottom here. Like that. That is our stamping done. Right, all we've got to do now is colour in. I have got... I don't want that. It says it's Granny Apple Green. It's Old Olive Dark I need. Which I've got. And we're just going to colour in the leaves and the stem I'm 
that's one. Right, I'm going to go over that black or grey bit with a bit of green. And try and follow this stem down. There we are. Then I have got dark real red to colour the flowering. And with the green again, I'm just going to just go over the bottom. Oh, I forgot to colour the budding. And that is our stamping and colouring done. How quick and easy is this card? So we'll stick this card a little bit of sticking up there. Stick that onto our red piece. And we're going to put dimensionals on there. Oh dear. Running out of dimensionals. Waste not, want not. Right, and now we put this on our card base. Peel the backings off. And place this in the middle. Preferably straight. And that is our card done. You can do this with any flower. I think it looks really nice. Hope you like it. If you do, don't forget to subscribe. If you want to see more of my cards, that is. And if you press the bell icon, you'll be notified of any more videos I upload, which is usually a Monday, Wednesday and Friday. All I can say is thanks for visiting and I hope to see you again soon.